Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I know it's been forever. It's been so long. If you saw my last video, it was the day in the life with the newborn, which was filmed like, filmed like April 27th. We are all the way, <laughs> almost in September, probably by the time that you guys see this. But I decided to do like something a little different. I'm gonna go ahead and do like a little Target shop with me. So we're gonna walk around Target, look around Target, and just, I also need to get some household things. So yeah, we're gonna get the baby out. Boys are at the house with the sitter, and we're about to go into Target. stuff all the time over here. Little mushrooms. I actually know someone who's like obsessed with little mushrooms. <laughs> here. Oh look at those little log pillows. <laughs> this is like for the bathroom. Then they have like these little Cutting boards. These little candles. Oh, that one actually smells really good. I feel like they smell exactly the same, but they're two different scents. So this one is cinnamon chai cupcake and bourbon and apple. I feel like maybe because they're cinnamon in both, they smell exactly the same. These pillar candles. Everything's like fall colors right now. Look, they even have pumpkin candles this year. So big old pumpkin candles. And then just regular twisted taper candles. Look at these soap pots. I wonder if this is just like one compartment though, or like can you put it two different soaps in there? Oh wow, look at all this stuff, that's 50% off. Is that Wait, so is all of this like 50% off? Oh, there's a Those are really good, like if you eat on the go a lot. You can put like salad down here with like all your toppings. Then it has a little cup for your dressing. And then they have a lot of these. They're like for your Stanley cup, but this one it looks like it's more versatile. Yeah. Pencil storage. These little backpacks. Is all of this stuff really 50% off? These are 50% off. Oh my gosh, because I want new lunch bags for the boys. I wish there was like one more color that wasn't a girly color. So I guess I'll get two blues and then the two yellows that fill. A pizza container. Oh. So much 
of this stuff is so cute. Like, look at this. A sensory match. This is a mem- oh! You can shoot the soccer ball in there though. They have like all the Halloween stuff out. I gotta go to the bathroom. We don't celebrate Halloween. Halloween, Halloween, Halloween. Look at this. How stinking cute. A bedroom doorbell. Also, oh, this stuff is on Ooh, clearance. Let's see. I was just saying I needed some more books for the boys. So I'm going to dig through these real quick. Let's take a look. Oh, look. 20% off denim tees and tanks for the family. But 20% off. So this is only like $6 off. So instead of 36 these would be like 30 bucks. I need some more jeans and I like these. I just don't think I'm 14 anymore, but I'm gonna look at Wild and Fable because they're cheaper than Universal Darts. But look at that. Women dresses also 20% off. Yeah, let's find the cheap clothes. There's nothing I love more than a good, like, cropped sweater. These are really pretty. So this is a, a New Day brand, $28. They have these different colors, but it kind of bothers me that they have them by these sweats, but none of these match this. Oh, look, they have a few more down here. So yeah, then they have, like, your nice neutral colors, which is more my speed, nice neutral colors. I kind of want a vest, but I don't know. I feel like I'm not at a weight where I feel like that would be flattering on me. Personal preference, but those are super cute. They have them right above, like these are pants, that's a skirt. But I always wanted one of those. I just, I'm not at a point where I feel like it would feel flattering on me or I would feel secure wearing that. <laughs> I went in the wrong direction. We are now at the wild and fable section, but I would have to find the denim. The only thing about the wild and fable is that it's like for really young people. I'm neither one of those things. Oh look, but they also have it's like see same cropped sweater style. It's not as thick as the other one, but this one's twenty five. So I would probably go with the other one for three dollars more and get better quality. But they also have like some hoodies here. Uh oh, the hoodies are twenty eight. And then they just have like some sweatshirts for 20. What colors do they have? So they have the nude color, the seafoam green. I don't know, it's not picking up on camera very good, and blue. The thing I'm a sucker for is some good sweats, but I get all my sweats from Nike because they always have them on sale and then we get military discount. But look at all these sweats that they have. And they're like comfort colors. So stinking cute. Ooh, I like that this one has a really thick waistband. Oh, I love that. I'm wondering if this denim is a part of the sale because I don't see a sign like I did by the other denim. But I do see like the shirts and the tanks, but look at these shorts. How cute are these? And I, I need more comfortable shorts. 16 bucks, so. Again, I only buy stuff when it's on sale. <laughs> I also don't want acid wash jeans. So I'm debating on going and grabbing me a pair of the Universal Threads ones. Got some really cute overalls. Oh, look at these dresses. Remember all the dresses are 20% off. But like, where would I wear that? Not to church. So like, these remind me of like, grungy 90s or is that just me i 
I was gonna say I could get this one for church, but I'm realizing like it's a short dress underneath and then it's see-through towards the bottom, so. And not for 32 bucks. No ham, no turkey. Yeah, this is like very like, everything they have going on. Like, look at these capris. Like, I feel like I've seen this in a lot of 90s movies where they have like the little tank top that's like kind of cropped with these like tight leggings and like some platform like sandals. Very 90s of Target. <laughs> oh, these are my jam. These type of dresses here. Kind of like body dresses. Yeah, see, let me. Yeah, it's super long. I'm baby carrying, so. Yeah, how much are these ones? Because all the dresses are 20% off. I did see a 20% off sign for the dresses at the Wild and Fable 25. It's not bad. All right, I think I'm done looking at the clothes. I'm actually out of concealer and then I also need a eyeliner. So I've heard great things about the e.l.f. liner, so I'm probably gonna get that liner, but let's, let's review a few products that I've tried. I did not like this e.l.f. grip grip primer. I feel like it made me break out. Didn't really do anything for my makeup. Now this, however, this Halo Glow Liquid Filter, absolutely love it. I really do love it. You can wear this by, I like to put on concealer and then put this on the rest of my face, powder it. Looks amazing. Um, I was not a fan of the putty primer. I feel like it clogged my pores also. Again, all of this is personal preference, you guys. Now this doing coconut setting mist, this used to go off back in the day. Like back in the day, went off. If you're still somebody who uses setting mist, try that one. Um, Elf Camo CC Cream, it felt like it was way too much for me. I really wish Elf would come out with like a tinted skin tint, but they, yeah, so. First of all, let's get a concealer. I need a concealer. We're going to go with light sand, I think. Maybe I would have to look at the undertones. This is light sand, but it looks a little warm. I need something a little more neutral. So maybe light peach. That looks too cool toned. Um, what about light beige? We're gonna try like beige. Yes, I'm not sure. I think it's this eyeliner that people love that's super matte. So the intense ink eyeliner, blackest black. I've also really been wanting to try their glow re re reviver, reviver, lip glow oil, whatever situation this is. I've really been wanting to try that, but not today since I had to buy two makeup products already want to have your nails done and you want to save money you guys anything from kiss is really good um i'll try to do a video on it one day but i know how to make these last like two weeks and they're super good and they have really pretty styles like this right here this right here is one of my favorite styles it's also one of brian's favorite styles and then i really like these just bare ones these ones do are not these are ones are very, very see-through. So I wasn't the biggest fan of the jelly color, um, but yeah, you can get these nails to last up to two weeks. Question, how do y'all feel about like the tree hut scrubs? Ooh, pink and pop. I wonder if we're gonna smell that. This one smells like a candle that you would get from Bath and Body Works. I don't know how I would feel like putting that on and like smelling it all day long. Um, I also saw that they had a firming body oil. I want to try this. Gosh, guys, what? What are we using these days? Um, I found that the Kotex has like a clean brand, which is what I've been using. I actually need to buy more because I don't know, something happened underneath my sink and ruined all of them. But I've been using that one. I've also tried the L brand. I haven't yeah. tried the Honey Pot brand. But the L brand is just overpriced to me. I, I don't know. I can't justify it. I used to buy this carpet freshener. Now I just make my own with baking soda and essential oil. <laughs> You're so cute. Um, 
And then right now, my favorite scent of Febreze is actually this um, Refresh and Energize one. And then I think my second one that I like would be one of the Unstoppables ones down there. But right now, it's this one. Okay, so I also need a Dawn Power Wash. Um, love how they have a free and clear, but I absolutely love this apple scent. And then we need a dish soap for the baby's bottles. Um, this is the one I buy for, like they have a free and clear dish soap for his bottles right there. And I think that's it. I think I just gotta grab toilet paper now. I gotta check my list. So the toilet paper I want is all the way back there. I can't reach it. These are the times that I miss my kids because I would have them stand in the basket and climb up there. Oh, yeah, I can't reach it. I have someone who's getting fussy, so we're about to head out. <laughs> yeah, we're about to go. We're about to go. Okay, we're getting a little bit fussy here. Huh. We're getting a little bit fussy? Yeah, so we're about to go. I said we were about to go. I actually really love the Mi the Miel line. This is actually one of my favorites. I wanted to try a different deep conditioner right here. I think this one, uh, no, this is the coil custard. Um, but I absolutely love this, so I may just have to get it. That's the only one I have. I was looking for an edge control, but I don't see an edge control. So. I'm just gonna grab this and be on my way. <laughs> As we are back home, the total was $165, not too bad. Kind of getting used to almost $200 of stuff looking like this, kind of getting real used to it, which is sad. So I did go ahead and just get this toilet paper because I couldn't find something that was um, like this many rolls and this affordable. This was like pretty much a dollar per roll because it was 18 dollars for this 18 pack <laughs> we got dog food um i did go ahead and go with the clean and secure again just because i had to get two packs i got the regular and the heavy I like, I like to use the heavy at nighttime and the regular during the day so i did get two packs of those i will be storing these somewhere else this time um i did go ahead and also pick up that tropic that tree hut tropic glow firming body oil I was about to sneeze again. We got some chungles or what are these actually called? Elastics. So these are actually called elastics. I hear people call them hair ties. I wanted black. They didn't have black. So I just settled for this color. Oh, well, um, I could, I got some bobby pins. They did not have an all black set. So settled for this one. I got the eyeliner, the concealer. I got this body oil for Brian. Went ahead and got that hair mask that I like to do. I, I use it once a week. Got the Dawn Power Wash, the dish soap, the fabric um, softener. We got um, mouthwash. And then I did go ahead and get the boys these lunch bags. I just realized they were different shapes. And I wish I would have realized sooner because I would have got one of these in this shape so we could tell the difference. But got these little lunch boxes so that way once it starts to cool off again, we can start having our picnics at the park again. It's supposed to start cooling off next week. So hopefully next week we can... Next week we also start school. So there's that um and then um i went ahead and got me these jeans i was able to find a size 14 and these actually came out to 26 bucks so they were actually 10 dollars off you guys so go ahead and hit up target check it out i don't know how long they have them but again like i said everything at target was very 90s look it even says mid-rise 90s baggy so i'm gonna use these for church tonight and i'll try to remember to give y'all a little ootd of how i wore it but yeah, and then all these books came out to 50 cents, you guys. And I want to see if these lunch bags came out to $1.50. Uh, yeah, so the lunch boxes came out to $1.50 each. So yeah, that's everything that I got, you guys.